eight Austin entrepreneurs are going head to head to compete for a really big prize. And tonight you get to weigh in on who wins. Yeah, it's called the reverse pitch competition. It started with more than 85 contestants, but it's now down to eight, as Sally mentioned. And Alicia Inns is going to help us get to know a finalist a little bit better throughout the morning. Good morning, Alicia. Hey, good morning, John and Sally. Yeah, so those eight finalists are competing to present the best idea or concept of taking some repurposed materials from local businesses and then, yes, exactly that, repurposing them and using them for different things that I don't think a lot of us would actually think about doing. And they are going to make their final pitches to an expert panel of judges tonight. And I want to introduce you to the first one that we're going to be talking to this morning, Santiago Diaz with Austin Building Materials Depository and Working Space. I wanted to check that. It's a long title. Good morning. Good morning. Thank so, you. are you excited? Very much. Yeah. Very much. Somewhat nervous, in fact. I was going to say, tell me what you are repurposing. What What are the different things? Books. I was looking at so many different things that I think we don't look at and think about, maybe repurposing like this. Right. So the competition, I think, uh, includes six businesses with multiple materials. Um, the Tops and Grains Brewery. They have a lot of spent grain. Dozens of thousands of pounds of that spent wow. grain a month. Um, Goodwill has tons of crushed glass and crushed plastic, um, recycled reeds, like you said, yeah. throws away a lot of books, um, thousands of books, tens of thousands, they each weigh at least a pound. They also have a lot of vinyl, uh, vinyl records and magnetic tape. Um, there's wicker canvas is yeah. another material. Build a sign throws away very high quality plywood. It's weather resistant, lasts dozens of years. Vinyl banner. Um, and these are materials that, you know, throughout the world are prime building materials. The grain um, can be made into a prime building material through a process of drying it and mixing it with aggregate, with Texas lime. But the grain is also a wonderful feed. And, you know, farmers sometimes can't always pick it up. And the brewery sure. doesn't always want to pay to have it disposed of. And it just produces a lot of uh, methane and CO2 as it breaks down. So my idea is just brokering these materials, you know. The competition had the businesses pitch the materials to us, the competitors, sure. and we had to think of an idea. And the idea that came to me was we just need to have someone that's dedicated to putting these back into the economy, not just here at home to farmers with the spent grain, for example, but you know our neighboring uh, country of Mexico. Throughout northern Mexico, these materials are already used as building materials. And it's like I said, these are prime materials that we can get down there and have people use. It's a win-win. The broker makes money by taking some off the transport that the industrial users yeah. here in town would pay for throwing it away. And then the people down there um, make money because they're getting their inputs a lot cheaper. Well, I think it's a very interesting technique in terms of the stuff that we don't think about and you guys looking at a way to repurpose it. So are you excited and ready to give your final pitch tonight? I am. I'm very excited. And you're right. You know, this materials could be repurposed here in Austin by crafters. Um, for a lot of different things. I mean, they make handbags out of the magnetic tape, yeah, the vinyl banners. Um, I see a lot of also handbags, but mostly artisanal things that could be made with these materials. There are a lot of artists at the initial opening, um, and I think a lot of them came up with a lot of great ideas also that are competing with mine. Well, I wish you the best of luck today. You can actually vote online as well. That's until 5 o'clock tonight. We're going to put that link for you at cakesand.com. Santiago, thank you, and good luck to you. Thank you.